In this video, I'm going to talk about knowledge articles template. Now, what is a knowledge article template? So knowledge article template is a template for defining your knowledge article. Now, as you know, a knowledge article is basically an information about uh, getting some things done or getting some issues resolved or some information about the issue at hand. Okay, so as you see in my screen, I'm in a customer service hub app. I'm in my knowledge article section under knowledge. I can go ahead and create my knowledge article. So let's imagine like everyone starts creating their own knowledge article. Okay, they can put a title, they can put a keyword description, and then they can start designing the content. Now, uh, if there are five users within an organization and all those five users start creating their own way of creating content, there won't be any standard set. Okay, so uh, think about a scenario whereby you have, like, say, uh, authentication based issues for a portal. Okay, and there might be multiple ways through which you can resolve that issue. Okay. Now, what if an organization has some standard consistency pattern or guidelines defined for setting up those articles? Now, if I get a clean slate for the content to be presented for the knowledge article, I can type in my own content. But what if we have some set standard which talks about, uh, say, let's assume I'm just putting some structure like say, introduction, uh, then uh, steps, and then uh, uh, inferences and uh, conclusion okay let's assume that this is some kind of a structure which i want everyone to fill within my organization okay i can put an introduction i can put a steps and i can put an inferences and i can put a conclusion against every article which i publish okay and i can make it uh, a bit more fancy by making it like well formatted okay so if this is that uh, structure which i want and i want everyone to fill that then i need to put some sort of a placeholder uh, when the user starts creating the knowledge article now how do i do that okay now here i can't do uh, i can't just see anything over here it's it comes with a clean slate okay now let me again go to knowledge article and now i can see another option over here uh, which is called as new from template. Now it says in new, you can create new blank new uh, knowledge article with a clean slate. And here new from template means you need to select some sort of a template. Okay. Post provisioning uh, the knowledge article. Now here I can select the template. Now from where this knowledge article template came. Okay. How do I go into this UI? Okay, one option is you can go from here. You can just say new knowledge article template. Okay, and then you will lose the context and then you need to go back. Alternatively, what you can do, you can just cancel this out and go into say customer service admin center, which is in another app within Dynamics 365 customer service. Go to knowledge and go to article templates. Now here, if you click on manage, it will take you to the article template page. Now here, whatever things you're going to create will be an article template okay. let me create one article template for um, first we need to select the language which is i'd say english okay and then i will uh, create a template and the template is for um, say maybe portal authentication okay And I can put some placeholder uh, title and keywords, say portal auth, and I can put some keyword, you know, login, password, authentication, authorization, etc. Okay. And in the content, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to put the actual content, but I'm going to just put the placeholders. You know? And here, maybe I can format this however i want okay so if i make this a bit maybe a bit bigger size let me make it 20 okay and i'll take this formatting step and i'll just do it like this okay now my template is ready okay oh uh, hmm. oops okay, now my template is ready 
uh, and then I can um, save this article template. I call it this a portal authentication. Okay, and I save and I'll do a save and close. Okay, now my temp I have created a template. Let's uh, again go back into the knowledge articles. Now let me discard all the other changes and I say new from template. The moment I click over here, it will ask me for searching for knowledge article template. Now this is the one which I have created now. If I click this, select a template, then automatically whatever was existing within the template will pop up as a part of title keyword. And if you see the content area, the placeholders are there. You just need to go and replace this text and say uh, this article It's about portal authentication login error. Okay, and then I can put some steps around it, you know. One dot, two dot, three dot, you know, and then I can put an inference, I can write a conclusion, and I can now name this article. I'll say this is portal authentication issue, but this is password incorrect. And similarly, I can create for some other purpose as well, you know. And once you put all these things, you just save, save and close, and your knowledge article is ready. Provision from the knowledge article template, which you provisioned a while back, okay? And uh, once you view this article, it will be as consistent as what you want. Uh, and this all things are coming from the template. Now you can do all other things as well, like there is like a summary section whereby you can fill more other uh, details like the subject, publish on expiration date and all. But the whole purpose of this particular uh, video was to show you how to first create an article template and then how to provision an article out of that article template. Okay. So that's it, folks. Uh, thanks for watching.